The Fassier Duval Telescopic IM System Rescue Instruments 3.0 by Pega Medical. This method is not appropriate for retrieval or revision of an implant if prior permanent deformation of the nail has occurred. Female Retrieval Technique Step 1 If bone has grown over the head of the female component, the use of the female tree fine is necessary. Pick the tree fine corresponding to the implant size. First, advance a guide wire in the bone all the way in the cannulation of the female component to guide the female tree fine. Then, the female tree fine can be used manually or on power to clear a path for the female component. Step 2. Use the female driver to unscrew the female component. The female driver must be fully engaged into the hexagonal drive of the implant. Step 3. If the female component cannot be removed with a female driver, the female retriever must be used to pull it out. To assemble the female retriever, insert the female retriever driver in the female retriever handle and thread it. Then choose the cartridge that matches the size of the implant. The cartridge is made of an expandable hex, a cone shaft, and a removable clip. Insert the cartridge and thread it in the female retriever. Remove the clip. Be careful to remove the clip in a linear motion to avoid pushing the hex onto the cone to avoid pre-expansion. Hand tighten the cartridge to remove the gap. Do not over tighten as this poses a risk of pre-expanding the hex. Step 4. Once the assembly is done, insert the female retriever over the guide wire and engage the cartridge in the head of the female component. Rotate the female retriever counterclockwise if the hex is not engaged properly. Verify engagement under imaging. Remove the guide wire. Attach the torque handle and apply counterclockwise rotation until the limit is reached. A click sound will be heard. Remove the torque handle. Unscrew the female component and pull to remove it from the bone. Assembly of the male retriever. Step 1. The size of the shaft and tube corresponds to the size of the implant to be retrieved. The size of each component of the male retriever is marked on each component and is identified by a color code as shown on this table. Select the required size for use before starting the assembly process. Once the required size of shaft and tube is selected, insert the shaft into the tube as shown. The tabs of the shaft must be fully engaged inside the notches of the tube. Step 2. Slide the handle assembly onto the mechanical assembly until it bottoms out. Verify that the flats on the drive shaft are aligned with the flats on the handle. If not, Use the torque handle to turn the drive shaft in a counterclockwise direction until the flats line up. Insert the shaft and tube assembly into the handle by lining up the flat surfaces. Disengage torque handle from male retriever assembly to prevent inadvertent deformation of the single-use shaft. Attach the cap by threading it into place. Male Retrieval Technique Step 1 Male Tree Find Bone can occlude part of the intramedullary canal, making insertion of a male retriever or removal of the male component difficult. In order to address this problem, Pega Medical has designed specialized tree fines. A tree fine of the diameter corresponding to the male components can be used manually or on power to clean a path for the male retriever. Take care not to come in contact with the wings of the male component when advancing the tree fine. Warning. Retract the tree fine to clean the teeth if advancement becomes difficult. Step 2. Under fluoroscopy, locate the end of the male component and mount the male retriever onto it. Make sure that the end of the male component is fully inserted into the male retriever before tightening. The hole in the side of the tube should not be visible. Mount the torque handle. To lock the shaft over the male component, Turn the torque handle counterclockwise until the torque limit is reached. An audible click will be heard. Remove the torque handle after tightening. Once the nail is secured in the instrument, turn the male retriever handle counterclockwise. Simultaneous rotation and pulling might be necessary as the male component is unscrewed.